Hello fellow 3D printers. This is my Blender 3D printing course that I wanted to share with you. We're going to be using this playlist to teach you how to use Blender's new 2.8 beta. So this video will just be teaching you the user interface and we're going to be using Suzanne the monkey right here, my favorite, to learn how to actually make something 3D printable. So let's go ahead and dive in. Uh, this is actually part of a full class that you can get on my website. In our first section, we're going to be learning the user interface. We're just going to be getting to know Blender and try and just kind of make it a little less scary looking. And we're going to be using my favorite object, which is the Suzanne model, to kind of learn the basics of editing, moving your windows around, what all the different windows do. And you will have your first 3D designed object by the end of this section. Let's go ahead and jump on in it. In this lesson, I just want to introduce you to Blender. Welcome to Blender 2.8 Beta. So I know it can be intimidating at first glance, but don't worry, we're going to introduce you right now. So let's just start left to right. We have the File button where you can save and export and import objects. So let's save as UI Basics. Next we have the Edit where we can undo and redo and go to our preferences. And next we have render where you can render out photographs of your amazing 3D designs. The window tab allows you to modify the viewing style and the help if you need the manual or help from the Blender community. And next we have the workspaces. So you can see that we have the layout, the modeling, sculpting, UV editing, texture painting, shading, animation, rendering, compositing, and scripting. So we're not going to use all of those. We're mainly going to stay on layout. And let's just double click on that. Go ahead and double click and rename that to 3D printing. And click away. And now we're going to just stay on that 3D printing tab. Over to the right corner we have our scenes and layers. So this is where you could add a new project inside of the current project that you're in. So now we're inside of a new scene and you can also switch back. And the view layer, these can be used for multiple views of a scene and also used when doing advanced rendering. And next we have our 3D viewport. This is where we will be moving around and editing our 3D designs. To the left we have our tools which we will use to add and manipulate our 3D printing models. To the right we have the information tab and this is a convenient pop-up that just gives us more information about the item we have selected. And below that we have the 3D printing tab which is a blender add-on that helps you inspect and export out your 3D printable designs. Next we have the outliner which is where we organize the scenes, collections, and layers of our 3D projects. Below that is the properties window, and these are just different tabs that allow us to add effects and manipulate our designs in a really powerful way. And below that we have the timeline, and this is just a time indicator that will help us when we're rendering out beautiful photographs of our 3D printed designs. So hopefully this video helped make Blender's interface a little bit less intimidating. So my challenge to you in this lesson is to just click around on all the different tabs and really just play around in Blender and I'll see you in the next video.